Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Deep Fear Blind-ish on the Sega Saturn. Let's press start and let's load our game. So when I say blind-ish, uh, as in the other parts I've explained, uh, it's because I played the first disc a couple of years ago. But I forgot, so it's kind of blind-ish. Second disc will be completely blind when we get to it. Link in the description if people want to watch a true blind, my true blind reactions. But anyway. Okay, so it's currently a new day. It is currently... Uh, seven o'clock no tell like quarter to seven on new year's eve so please excuse any dogs barking or fireworks you may hear through the rest of this playthrough or well these few parts that are coming up i'm gonna hopefully do a massive chunk of this t t today and tonight uh so yeah what a way to spend new year's eve playing deep fear drinking copious amounts of coffee and and uh you know just being nerdy i guess anyway so let's play we were in the junk area passageway. Okay. Ooh, I'm excited to play this. Been looking forward to this all day. Now loading. So, what were we doing? I remember I was looking for the save point for quite a while. My HP is a little, little low there. Or halfway. Okay, so I'm just going to explore. I don't know what I'm doing, really. Anything to say about that? No. What is in this door? I can go through it. Chemical treatment room. Okay. It's underwater. Okay, stick your breathing thing on. There we go. Um, right. What's in the jacket? Anything in the jacket? No. <laughs> that looks so stupid, that thing sticking out of his mouth. Or, but, you know, whatever. You obtained Chemical B. Uh, great. Okay. I got Chemical B there. Anything about this big, giant machinery? Got anything to say about anything, John? Anything, John? No. Okay. So, yeah, my New Year's Eve is playing this game. Aren't I a fun person? I guess, you know, I just, you get old and you don't want to go out drinking anymore and partying. It, you just don't want to. It's just too much hassle. I don't, I kind of, yeah, you definitely get old when you kind of feel like, oh, that's locked. I need a level two junk key. Like, you get old, I'm thinking, I don't want to wake up the new year with a hangover. It's just, you know, what a way to start the new year feeling like death. So, you know. I'm just going to play games. But yes, if you hear fireworks and dogs barking, you know, I apologize. My microphone's going to sure it's going to pick them up. I'll hopefully try and stop recording when it gets near to midnight. So we don't hear the full effect of it happening. But, you know. Or maybe I might just play through midnight and you'll have to bear with it. I mean, this isn't a professional playthrough or anything. This is just me playing the game and rambling on about rubbish. Yay. Okay, what was I doing again? Oh, I, I forgot. There was this thing about the Brazilian stallion. I remember that. Uh, I think um, I think about his birthday was a ratio. Email for Pedro. Oh, I can't remember what the ratio is now. I think it was like 10, 25. But let's just go back and check the ratio real quick. And I, I didn't do much exploring in these rooms because um, the worker turned into a monstery thing. But because I was trying to find a save point. <laughs> it's like, yeah, there's a guy here crossed, had his legs crossed, but he turned into a monster, didn't he? So let's, let's just do an R charge real quick. There we go. Lovely. There's all these lockers here. There might be something nice in these lockers. An air grenade, that is nice. Another air grenade. Another air grenade. Loads of air grenades. No more air grenades. I can't hold any more air grenades. Yeah, the thing was over here, wasn't it? 10.25. I thought it was 10.25. That was the ratio. 10.25. Okay. Ooh, should I check the... Actually, when I'm here, I might as well check the room that's that was in the other place. Maybe that might be a good idea. Go through the other door. Oh, John, put... The, oh, quicker, John. I wonder why 
you still walk underwater like that. I, I, I think it might be a bit too hard in real life to do that. I know it's a game, so I can't really say much, but it wouldn't be easier just to swim, John? I'm just, just saying. I like the atmosphere in this game. It's a good atmosphere. It's a bit like... I like the lack of music. Like, like just the humming of the kind of the the bass you hear, like you know the the underwater bass. Just all you, that's all you really hear. It's it's a nice, it's nice. It it works. But what is in this room then? That was yeah, I did that. There was a dead guy on the floor that's obviously going to mutate at one point. Uh, I just want to double check. I haven't missed anything in here. This is where they manage to trash disposals. That's that word. Alright, Neth, it was in that room. That was a waste of time. Hmm. I'm, I'm drinking coffee at the moment. With some hazelnut syrup. It's getting stuck in my moustache. I have a full-grown winter beard at the moment. As my face will get cold without it. Okay. Oh, I wish he was a little faster by putting that, that tube in his mouth. Would be nice. Those bubbles do look pretty naff. At least they disappear when they touch the ceiling. That, that's that's good. Oh, I hear dogs barking. Oh, it's going to be one of those nights. Right, there we go. That's quicker. Um, right, we want to go to the chemical room. I think we need to pick up another. We've got chemical B. I think we need chemical A. Sort of makes sense. And, um... Then I think we need to mix some 10 to 25 in a machine. All oh, this area is flashing red. That can't be good, can it? It's running out of oxygen. Never mind. Just... Uh, that's the storage. Don't want to go to the storage just yet. Um. So yeah, I mean, like, I was talking about like, getting older. I just don't know. Just I just partying kind of just doesn't appeal to me anymore. I think that's the moment when you know you're older and you've grown up. I guess when you just rather stay in. With a nice cup of coffee or tea, whatever you poison, you just oh, I don't know. It's nicer. Okay, this room had the toxic, funky yellow gas. There we go. Let's explore this room correctly now. Oh, we can heal ourselves. I'll do that. Yeah. That's the map button. Uh, wrong button. That's checking a air grenade. Oh, that oh, I thought I was going to fix it then. I thought I had the health kit equipped to my thing, but I didn't. So, whoops. I'll have to go downstairs and pick up another one. Set. There we go. There we go. And, uh, there we go. Got the stuff done. Well, I wasted an air grenade, but at least now we've seen what that... Well, actually, no, I thought we saw... Actually, we might have seen it another part, didn't we, when we were fighting that really bad boss that just runs around the ladder. Okay, what's here, then? What's this? What's this? No, it's like going through a table, though. And a shadow. You obtain the researcher's diary. Oh, great, another part where we start with off with reading. Researcher's diary, March 31st. A special federally, federally funded closed area insecticide research project, Break Nest, has begin has begun to hit a wall. We still haven't been able to find a formula that isn't harmful to humans. We are now in the final stages of testing the two new drugs, drug A and drug B. Official names will remain confidential. That MI has developed. However, we are getting exper experiment results we never thought we would get. The fumes of the new insecticides are extremely harmful, possibly deadly, to humans. It turns out it is not so effective against insects. 
Well, this is great. Well done, you are fantastic researchers. You just completely just did the opposite of what you want. You were intending to do. Well done. The dis this dis disappointing result is not from a miscalculation, but from an unexpected chemical reaction. The mixture ratio of the two drugs will remain confidential. We have defined the characteristics of drug B itself as the fault. Drug B will have to be disposed of. As for drug A, we have found it that it has possible positive potentials for an insecticide, and we will continue our experiments. I have to discuss with Dr. Weinsberg what our immediate priorities are for the moment. And my researcher, Pedro Coulson. Okay, so we have drug A. They tossed it away and we picked it up. So I'm going to assume drug chemical A is here. Yeah. What's this? No, no, can't. No, what's this? Emergency aid kit. Emergency aid kit. What's that do then? I assume. What's the emergency aid kit do? Recovers your HP a lot. Ah. Got any more in the cabinet for us? Nope, nothing here else here, I don't think. Right, well, that's nice. Okay. So then we go into the room with the Pedra. I'm going to assume that that research is Pedra. We mix those two chemicals up and it's going to create something. I think, if I remember from the last part, it, um, for some lasers. Makes us see lasers in that room or something. Something like that, I think. I'm really enjoying that this is this is my New Year's Eve. Last year I didn't do anything. I think I was asleep. Which is a good way, another good way to spend it. Got anything to say, Pedro? I'm I feel dizzy from fever. Did you find the ratio com of compound? Data sheet of chemical development, none of it seems useful. How how do you know, John? How do you know? There's nothing left, or there was something in there. I think it was a key, wasn't it? Right. Uh, that's where we use the the machine. I think that's the. I, if I remember correctly, that's where the, the the thing is for the drugs. Yeah, and then we need to well, we use the drugs on it. So chem well, the chemicals. Oh. What does it say? A small bottle with purple liquid inside. Some difficult technical terms are written on the back. Okay. A small bottle with green liquid fluid inside. Some difficult technical terms are on the back. Okay. So, 1025. Oh, oh yeah. I remember this. I remember this. Oh, yeah. Oh, my reactions are terrible, man. Oh, Alright, we'll do this. No. Nah. I thought I hit, had 10 then. What? Okay, I'm, I'm, I, I keep hitting 9. I start. That's way too soon then. There we go. Okay. 25. 10. 20. Yay! There we go. That was... I don't know how sample A gave me so much trouble. I think I was just like... I think I... I, I think I you you press it once and you have to press it again. I think I was having it held down and that was the problem. But never mind. Right, I've got an insecticide that somehow this machine is made into like a walkie-talkie. Oh, he's changed, of course. That, so that just sounds like he's had an accident. Is he going to be like a unique monster looking or is he going to look like the other ones? I'm actually intrigued. No, he's, he's, he looks like the other ones. Right, I've run out of... I need to change my weapon. I've run out of that really bad gun. Oh, no, don't put it away, John. John, don't walk into it, John. John, there we go. It was sort of my fault there, because I was pressing the wrong buttons, but never mind. Right, so he's dead. Pedro and his buddy are die uh, have died. That's that that that's hit the. Uh, I was thinking, didn't didn't the thing land in the in the other air? I don't. Oh oh, there's something's out here now. Oh hello. Come on. 
you know, the, the monster designs are pretty nice. The, the, the models are quite detailed. Oh, why am I hitting? There we go. I wish there's a little bit more of a feedback when you hit them. That blood is really kind of quick. Are they both dead? They are both dead. That's quite a nice view, that, isn't it? Shadow's kind of mangled up in their blood now. But, uh, oh well. Okay, so we've got the insecticide. We go back downstairs, don't we? Yes. Um, well, yeah, like, what was it? I was going to say about this game. This game, I mean, yeah, like the feedback when you hit them, the blood just appears really quickly. I wish it was a bit more like Resident Evil, where the blood kind of stays for a bit. And makes a little bit more of a feedback. That's that woman one, I think, isn't it? Oh, great time to reload there, John. She dead? Yeah, she's deflating. Okay, now we want to use the... Well, this is running out of oxygen, but... There's no point checking an air grenade. We won't be in here for too long. Why well, have they kind of gated this area? I don't I don't get it. Surely the gate would be on this side. Oh. Oh, nice little cutscene. I liked that. I love how you just ran away to like Nope. You've used an insect insecticide, okay. Lasers on. Lasers off. What? I mean, again, what's the point of these? Oh, whoops. I I didn't mean to. Oh, wow, the cutscene's changed because it's got gas there. That's nice. I didn't mean to actually touch the lasers. I wanted to use this R charge machine here. That's not actually an R charge machine now. Whoops. What's this do? Well, I thought they were an R charge machine, but it's not. It looks like an R charge machine. Right. Well, never mind. Whoops. At least the actual cutscene. We just now we know the cutscene was slightly different with gas. That's that is a great attention to detail there. That we better get through here before our 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 machine, our regulator, runs out of air because that that won't be good, will it? Okay. But another thing I was gonna say about the lasers. Why why would you have lasers that deactivate like that? You know what? Well, I don't get that. You know. And why would you have this room gated? You would have the one going into the medical research gated because that's what you don't want people getting into. Actually, yeah, this goes... Oh, this just goes to medical research. I mean, what's the point of gating? What? Well, I don't get... It's only just for plot, isn't it? Really. Okay. Through here. Yeah, well, you know. I can't complain. At least it's got slight logic and, like, Resident Evil puzzles. I mean, Resident Evil 3 is just... And 2 is like, why do I have to have these... Oh, oh, wait, whoa! Oh, I remember these. These are really annoying, aren't they? Uh, uh. They're like, oh, these are dogs, aren't they? These are like Resident Evil dogs. Oh, don't reload, John. Ah! 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 Come, ah, get here! There we go. Wow, they take a bit of chunk of health off, don't they? What's this? The air system is damaged. We must replace the IC chip. Oh, oh I can do an R charge, though. Can also save the game here, so that's good. Nothing useful here. Oh, there's a cage is broken. So they're, they're mutated dogs, then. They have to be. It's a dog cage. It's destroyed from within. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice pool of blood here on the floor. Um, it's a progress chart of the researchers. What were they experimenting? Maybe it wasn't aliens from that spacecraft up in the in the sky. Maybe it, it's a mouse cage. Oh, maybe they're maybe they're they're mice then. But um, 
Maybe they were it's research. Maybe it's like umbrella. Ooh. Intrigue. Okay, this place is running out of oxygen, so. This place has run out of oxygen. Okay. What's down here? Let's go this way first. Uh, what's in here? It is guards quarters. Oh, maybe find a new gun in here. All right. That's nothing. That looks like that. Looks like that would be like a map or something. But I, I remember this game just gives you all the maps straight away, straight to wait, straight away. You know, deactivate the laser lock system. Sure. Lock has been deactivated. Oh, he's going to turn, isn't he? The monitors to each room, they're not functioning anymore. Okay. I came to fix the AS, but what was that thing anyway? It must have been a nightmare. Have you got the AS? He Hello? No, no, he's not. Actually, I need to get somewhere to refill my weapons. I'm actually running out of ammo. That's a first. All right. Um, what's the ah? That's a, there's a there's a thing there. It's the retinal lock system. You need to have someone from MI Co. to unlock it. Ah, so we probably need, like, Gina Weinsberg. Something like that. Because wouldn't she from the MI? Alright, that's where we were at. Wait, no, that's where we came out from. Yeah, that's where we came out. We need to go up this ladder. This game is kind of just hurting us into, like, one direction. Like, it's like, you go, you have to go this way. Which, you know, it's fine. I've got no problem with that. It stops me getting completely lost, so... Okay, this this place has run out of oxygen too. Fantastic. Uh, right, medical industry. Uh, what's this here? Gina's room. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Oh, cutscene. John, what's happened to the big table? There was an accident. And you? I couldn't get out because of the air system damage. Look at this. I found this cell from one of the creatures. And this is a mouse's cell with the creature's cell implanted. Is this? The creature cell is transforming into the mouse cell at an unbelievable speed. Transforming? Right. This cell transforms into other living things and copies their original characteristics. I've never seen anything like this. I've seen it. A human turning into a creature. The transforming cell eats the original cells at a high speed and eventually takes over the body. Is there anything that can stop it? It must have a weak point. Something has to be done, but there isn't enough data. <laughs> Sorry, I have had this cold since last night. <laughs> cold? Have you been attacked by a creature? Any other symptoms besides a cold? I've been attacked a couple of times. Really, no other symptoms. Can I draw some blood? Am I, am I being taken over, too? I don't know, but it just hit me that you've been attacked and haven't changed. If you don't change, we may have a lead. I'll let you know the results. And what are you going to do? I have to get back to the CCD area. Okay. But to get out of this area, you have to go through the net lock system. And how do I do that? You need the help of an MI area researcher. If you could operate the air system, I could help you. But we can't go out because there's no air. Right. 
Oh. What about the chimpanzee? Anthony? I can't find him. I'm worried. Oh, are we... Are we a mute? Are we mutating? And John's voice actor is just beautiful. I'm, I'm honestly, it's. They could have got. I, well, that's not. I, I mean, it's terrible, but it's just so bad. I love it. You know. Anyway, let's. There's some health here. Let's go and use the health. Yep. Oh, it's. Oh, yep. Health done. Good. Right. I was thinking. Oh, what's that red one I picked up? What is that red one I picked up? Resu re resuscitation kit. What does this one do? Restores your HP fully. Okay. It's the latest electron microscope. Okay, cool. It's, a, it's the same thing. Okay. I need to find the chip. You obtain Gina's memo. Okay. Gina's memo. It seems it paras... It's, it seems it parasites only on mammals duplicates itself signs very much like the common cold infects the brain at a very fast pace can be found by blood tests multiplies an explosive speed spreads from host to host if exposed to the outer world an estimated 264 hours 11 days is all it would take to wipe out the mammals on the planet should i contact captain clancy and have him stop the deep blue project right away does not parasite on subjects that are infected by other viruses, example influenza virus. Weakens dramatically when exposed to oxygen. Possible weakness. Mm, we had a cold, so maybe we're saved because we had a cold. <laughs> hey, what's in here? Oh, right, where did I find this AO? This I, uh, this chip then? Is it not in here? Do, do you have it, love? Can you operate the AS? Then you can do it. Without the AS fix, I'm afraid to go out. Okay, well, I need the AS stuff. I didn't mean to turn that way. Some... Yeah, I know. Alright. Um. Well, I'm surprised that there's, like, no... Alright, I guess the, AA, A, the It's not in here, then. Hmm... Oh, there goes a firework. There goes another one. It's not even like midnight here, guys. Come on. Right, uh, right. So, oh, I was trying to find this, uh, this chip now. Where is this bloody chip? Like I said, this is blind-ish because I can't remember what I did. I don't know where things are. It's not a game I, I've played it's lots like Resident Evil where I know everything where everything is. So, okay, uh, that is the way we came in. Let's check the map real quick. Yeah, that's where we came in. Um, ah, oh, wait, is this a passage passageway down there? No, that's just a bad camera. Okay, let's check the guards' quarters then. Maybe he now has an AS chip. Oh, now he's changed. What's wrong? I was bitten by a mouse that came out of the ventilation and got sick. What do you want? I want to repair the air system. I just threw away the old IC in the junk area. We have it. The air system can be fixed. Here. I'll be right back. Don't move. <laughs> no way. Not even at gunpoint. There are creatures all over the place out there. I love how everyone's Australian in this game. Okay, level two junk key. Okay, so we've got that now. Uh, ooh. I'm playing for half an hour. I'll, I'll do this. I'll do this AS AO quest, and then I will. Then I will. Um, Pull it apart there actually that makes that makes more logical sense than just ending it now 
Okay, right. So, where's level 2 junk at? Oh, it's down... Yeah, I remember. It's downstairs in the... Um, in the room where I saved... Where I started this part in. That's where it's at. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. An animus... Anim, an, Administration room for experimental animals. Okay. Bit of a mouthful that there game. What 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 a snappy and good name for it for a room. Okay, so this is Oh, it's these things. Oh dear. Ah, there's one there. Ah! Stuck on it. Right. Let's take care of these. Oh dear. They 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 kind of oh they're fast and hoppy. Oh these are annoying. The the well done, we found the more the annoying creatures in the game. You could die any time there, guy. Right, okay, they're dead. Oh, you can... Oh, no. I thought you could, like, do an auto-reload. Wow, my bullet's at 16. I'm running out of ammo. That's a bit scary. Maybe there's something in the storage. Anything in the storage? That I, ah, right here. Brilliant. Great, I can reload. Let's do that. Brilliant. That's good. Okay, where do we want to go to the junk area, which is this way, isn't it? It's in this room. And then that's it. I'm trying to remember, it, I'm trying to remember where everything's at because it's, um, obviously this game's got a bit of a backtracking kind of thing going on with it. Is it this way? No, it's not. It's the other way. My oxygen's running a little bit low. My regulator. That's a bit, a bit worrying. But I, I could go to the e pool that where where Mookie died and and re refresh. But I don't want to. I want to play a little bit of a tense game here. It's more fun. Besides, I can just toss an air grenade, can't I? Ah, there's loads of air in the junk area. That's fine. That's good. Okay. Around the corner, through here. That coffee's a little bit cold now. We want to go to the right, I think. There you go. I like the, the air system in this game. It's a quite a unique kind of thing. It's really... It's really... It's, I wish it was a little bit well... A little bit more thought out. So it was a bit more tense to, to kind of like... Because at the moment I don't feel tense with the air system, so maybe, maybe later on in the game I will. But, but I do like the mechanic. It's a nice, interesting mechanic. I'm not super keen on all this, on this all this backtracking, but it, at least it's not as bad as Resident Evil or Silent Hill. So I will give it that. Oh no! Oh John, John, careful, guy. These things are here. Oh, there's three. Oh, the game. The Saturn is struggling with this. Hey, rude. Oh, ah. oh, is the, oh, these things. Are they dogs or are they right? It's just... Oh, that thing. That one. That one. Not reload. Ah. No. 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 You can die any time now. Slowly back backwards, uh, back backwards, walk backwards and shoot your gun, John. Reload, John. There you go. I wish you could, like, do manual reloading. That would be nice. Right, okay, so that's that done. Let's, uh, put our gun away. Uh, let's do an air system. 
And our charge. Yep. Exit menu. And we'll use... Actually, we can just... Oh, wrong button. I meant to press that one. Heal ourselves a little bit. There we go. Because uh, a little bit low on health there. This is the one we need the level 2 junk card, I think. No, it's not. Chemical treatment room. I think we've been in here before. I went in the wrong way, I think. Yeah, went, went the wrong way. But never mind. We can see this room again. Hello, room. Goodbye, room. Alright, see how. Oh, what? 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 No! Oh, I fell over. Get up, John. Well, these things have come back to life. There's a firework happening outside. Fantastic. Uh, item. Um, use that key. I'm just gonna run a I'm gonna run away from these, I think. Because uh, if they're gonna come back to life, then what a waste. Alright, okay. Ah, here it is. I see it. You obtained this replacement IC chip for the AS. What's this here? Nothing. He's got nothing to say about that. Why did we need a level 2 car to get in here? It's, an, it's not really anything special. It's just a machinery. It's just a plot card, isn't it, game? Um, item. Let's just look at this. Replacement IC chip. It's the old IC chip made by Shirharataka. Okay. Right, we're just going to leave, and we're just going to ignore these hopping things, because I can't, I can't be bothered fighting them. I think we're going to fix the AC system, and then we're going to call that... Oh, bit of slowdown. We're going to replace the... Repair the AC system, and then we... Or IC system, whatever, and um, we're going to call that part four. Um, right through here. Oh, okay. Hello. Didn't expect you. I will take care of you. Because that gave me a little little bit of a fright there. Not not much. Just a little like, oh, hello. Okay. I'm going to you know I'm really enjoying this game so far. It's a nice, it's a nice game. It's a nice, it's a nice game. It's a... It's a shame they've not done any more of this series. I would like to kind of see more of Deep Fear, of the, the, you know, as a series. Like, you know, see where it evolved to, but oh well. Because I like, I really do like the mechanics of the air, the air system. It's nice. It's a something a bit different. They're going to stick monsters in here, aren't they? Let's just get our guns out ready. No, no, they didn't. I am surprised. Okay, we want to go through the laser room. I think it's where we want to go. All right, stick our thing in our gob. I don't like those higher up camera angles like that. It makes me slightly nervous that they're going to drop something down on me now. Right, I'm going to go in the storage, the strage. I can't believe they've mistyped that on the, on the door. That's brilliant. They forgot the O, but never mind. Let's just recharge our um, guns while we're here, might as well. Okay, through here. I think this is the passageway and then we go and then we go into the medical well the experimental room for animals 
I am not for animal testing game though. You know, I, I think animal testing is cruel. So I hope Gina Weisberg has something coming to her to be honest. You know, karma all and all that. Okay, so we repair the system here and we're going to call that part four. I think that's a great, great end to this part. Okay, and we can then make the air come alive to this area. Okay, so item. Um, select, use. And then air system. There we go. Our charge. And save our game. Beautiful. Let's save over slot one. Would you like to... Yes, thank you. Thank you. So that was part four of Let's Play Deep Fair Blind-ish. Oh, I'm going to have a stretch. Uh, yeah. Excuse me. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I couldn't, couldn't wait. Oh, that was nice. Right. You just love stretching. It's good. Right, well, that was part four. If anyone's watching this, I hope they enjoy the series so far. Um, and hopefully everyone has a lovely day whenever I release this. What I'm going to do, what I've come up to, conclusion what I've done now is I'm going to, before I upload them, I'm going to make sure I, I finish, I film them the whole part, the whole game before I upload anything. And also I'm going to explore absolutely every single file before I start uploading the first one because I tend to forget or get distracted or... You know, and or something happens to a computer or something, and I kind of then lose the series. So, but uh, you know, I'm promised not to do that. So if I do everything before I start uploading, that way that doesn't happen, and I don't, I don't look like I'm, uh, I'm a lazy or something. But anyway, yeah, I'm rambling on now. Goodbye. Hope everyone has a lovely day.